I'm just kidding. I, 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 I was just being. I was just messing with you guys. <laughs> hey. Anyways, guys. Today, um, you're getting an extra life. You know what? If you die, this mushroom right here will grant you, allowing you to live again. The only thing is, you're starting your life from scratch. So that means you're going to be learning everything all over again from the time you were born, you know, learning how to walk and everything, and even going to school again, you know. All that jazz, but you get to live again. Because, but with the same personality, a same you and everything, because I don't know how, if reincarnation exists or not. Who knows? It probably does. But, I mean, obviously no one knows, because what I always thought reincarnation is, you die, but then you're like, you're another person, your soul still goes either to heaven or hell, but you relive as another person, but you don't remember your past selves. You know what I mean? I probably could have been past... I don't know. Anyways, guys. Um, enough about that bullcrap. Today, we're going to be reacting to another video by one of the best YouTubers out there. And it is called... The Ultimate Smash Bros. Say yes, guys. See? The... The Ultimate Smash Bros. So, and it has musical notes. So, I'm, it has musical notes. So, I'm thinking it's going to be some sort of musical. Let me make sure the volume is just right. Oh, God, no, 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 no. Turn that down. Uh, most of this is reading it anyways. So, I mean, I'll be happy to do that. And anyways, I kind of figured out what I would do for face cam. I'm going to shorten and put it on a little side here, because most of the time, SMG Force, um, little subtitles, because I like to have my face game either on the side or in the side corners, mainly in the little, in any of these four corners, um, that's usually where I have my face cam, it's a proper place for it in my opinion, mainly either the top right or bottom left. Um, so yes, but today we're going to do it right here, because in the corners it does sort of block mm. off, it does sort of block off the, um, the subtitles he puts, and you actually need to read those, they don't like have voice acting and everything. Um, you know what, yeah. Um, so yes, and for those of you who are wondering about the Namco Museum Remix Let's Play, um, that will be continuing on Tuesday, and I'm sorry about, on. Um, what is it? How on Thursday? What was it Thursday? No, it was not Thursday. It was Friday. And I took pretty much forever for each part to upload. But I got a lot done. And I've already got a, well, at least one vote for the next game for it. So that is pretty much going to be... I'm going to be getting on Tuesday. I'm just going to be doing as much as I can with the amount of memory space. Which is quite a lot. Um, at least almost three hours of memory space to record on, so that's like a really good thing, and my videos are casually pretty short on Namco Museum Remix. So yeah, um, nothing, really almost nothing would be holding me back from trying to fit, oh, that's the only thing that's going to be holding me back, if they do manage to reach the maximum memory space, from finishing the whole Let's Play on Tuesday. When all each part gets uploaded, who knows when? But I guess it's good that you guys still get a cliffhanger no matter how fast I record it. It's just how long it takes for it to upload for some odd reason. But anyways, let's go ahead and get into this. So today, again, go check out SMG4. He's a really good YouTuber, especially if you're like me and you love random humor. There are other people who react to his videos like GameCube Dude, something like 3000 or something like that. And the Ouija Kid Gaming, all we all react to his videos. I don't react to him that much anymore, but I used to react to him all the time on the old channel. So, anyways, guys, let's get into this. I'm done with my rambling. In three, two, one, go. Oh, what the? Lechy boy. Okay. Yeah, it's like a musical. Maybe we'll have people like to talk about too. Oh, 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 oh. Mario was jumping around. Final destination like a battleground. Then 
suddenly coming blue from the sky and smack me right in the eye. Worried about this and smash attack, but then accidentally hit a little me. Little Mac turn around and check on the beard. When the snake came out, it hit him. Middle of his head, jumped from his box and threw a grenade. But then Eggman swoops on the body. Eggman had his box with a sand before. Trevor came in with a giant ass gun. He unloaded on everybody at the scene when Haggard ran him over on his flying machine. He came to a hole as he saw a giant flash and sent his kid down and on Mr. Flash Smash. Fuck it now. Seriously. <laughs> this is the ultimate smash. Oh damn, I was getting mad at Eggman. Eggman, you better run your ass off. I mean seriously. Oh, what the fuck are they doing? <laughs> Let's just see how much this guy is going to be Did you get close to playing the character? What the heck? Oh, fuck. He's bending? Okay. Hi, bending. Uh, uh, why would he be? Oh, he needs to be a staff. Now it's fucking a six trophy. Then Angel sang out, pray, please help us, Senpai. And down from Nintendo, descended Sakurai. Oh. He looked upon these mods and yelled, Oh dear lord, quickly <laughs> unsheathing his samurai sword. He went on a rampage, shutting yeah, him boy. down. <laughs> took a test and a blink, rode into town. He took out his sword Ooh. and Sakurai. Sakurai got his keyboard and simply nerfed him. The nickling the girl and nickling the boy. And if you're ready, let's do it. Say your boy, Kamura. Kamura, and join the X-Force. But I'm sorry, fans, I chose a one sword. Sakurai, chocolate, let's just do it. Really? Big smoke, Professor Oak, every single time it's a big board. Every minute I drag his fire rope. Let's enjoy a red fire rope. Let's enjoy a red fire rope. Let's enjoy a red fire rope. This is him talking right now. That's, that's the guy making the video. Like, he the videos. Hey. 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 And he also has a gaming channel down there. And there's also a lot of I remember that. That freaking item book video. That was freaking, um. That was crazy and awesome. So, anyways, guys, that was. Um, SMG4's video, The Ultimate Smash Bros. And I guess I was right about the little musical notes, meaning it was going to be a musical kind of thing. And it might be, you know, that. <clears throat> but anyways, guys, uh, another great video by SMG4. I remember the last music one he did was Waluigi number one video a parody of the we are number one song from lazy town um he did that and that was pretty good with luigi and waluigi one thing i will say freaking like 
a bunch of Mario characters get their own spotlight. Like, Mario, at least he has the whole game. But also for the Mario franchise, we have series with Yoshi, Wario, DK. They all have a bunch of their own games and stuff. And, like, Luigi has a few of his own as well. Mainly the Luigi's Mansion. Like, the one on GameCube and the sequel on 3DS. But, I mean, like, um... Well, Luigi has a fan game, but that's about it. And he's even had plenty of times where he just didn't appear. Though I heard, I actually found out he was actually like the final boss or something like that. Not like really a boss, but the final challenger on the Mario... The Dance Dance Revolution Mario Mix, I think it was called. You, like, your last challenger is Waluigi, so... He gets a little spot right there, but I mean, the only one game where he actually is the main freaking character is a fan game. Nintendo never actually made a game. I can't remember what it was. Waluigi in the Eye or some shit like that. But it, what's sad, Waluigi doesn't have any actual official games out for him. And I'm just going to ramble on for a little bit if you guys want to. Just, just for you guys, just to lengthen this video for some odd reason. Give you guys something to watch. I'm going to ramble. So you know what? Prepare for me to ramble. I think, well, like, seriously, okay. Waluigi, why doesn't he have a fucking game? Not to mention, um, if for any of you who have played Mario Kart 7 for the 3DS, that was my first Mario Kart game. Back then, this was before I didn't really know much about Mario, but I didn't know about Wario and Waluigi. And well, I, I had one more character to unlock, and I figured, it w I haven't unlocked Waluigi yet. I had Wario on there, so I was like, it has to be, it, it's Waluigi. Besides, I, I already played his Trent Wally Pinball, which turned from the DS one. So, I finally collected enough coins for the character, and I was like, Okay, I unlocked Waluigi, and then I unlocked it, it was Metal Mario, and I'm just like... I... I was so utterly disappointed. Even I, did, I didn't even know how Waluigi never got attention back then, but I was still disappointed in Nintendo when they... Put Metal Mario, a metallic version of Mario, over an actual character like Waluigi. I was I was actually pretty pissed. <laughs> uh, it just made no sense in my opinion, and that's one reason. If I you when I play Mo um and by the way I will actually be in the Switch soon. My mom and grandma actually bought me one. As like a late birthday, but because they originally do it for my birthday, and they finally got one for me. And um, also, I want to give a shout out right here during this little ramble. As what I'm gonna talk about, we'll include this little person here. Uh, he's doing a let's play on Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. He's I'm pretty sure he's about finished with it. I'm sure he'll do live streams and stuff of it. He has a Discord server. He has a Twitter and a Google Plus. He's a friend of mine on Google Plus, and he helped me moderate the um. Nintendo 2 community and he even made a shout out video for me and Troy DX um, What is it one back when the Nintendo 2 community I ran when I ran that community and they were helping me Troy DX and mushroom Furry Ranger Anthony it was helping me out mushroom furry and um, Ranger Anthony does some pretty really good Mario Kart 8 deluxe videos So you should really go check them out Plus, he's doing a contest. In order to enter his contest, I'll go ahead and just tell you all the rules now. You have to like each of his Mario Kart 8 Deluxe videos, and you have to subscribe to him, and you have to be following him on either Twitter or Google+. I have entered the contest as someone who follows him on Google+, and I've also liked all the videos and subscribed to him. So, I'm either going to get Mario Kart 8 Deluxe to do that giveaway, and if I don't want to give away, I'll just go buy it myself. Because I really want to play it. That's actually my main reason for wanting the Switch just to play Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. I mean, I could care less about the Switch's features. That's actually what, in, um, the games are what actually inclined me to buy the Wii U. Um, I really couldn't, I could care less about its features. I just wanted to get it because of, oh, because of the games on, one of those was Mario Kart 8, the original one. Why I wanted to get a Wii U back, and when I did get a Wii U back in 2014, that was when that new Super Mario Bros. U, and I also heard a Super Smash Bros. coming out soon for, and even though it was coming for the 3DS as well, I wanted to get the Wii U version as well. So like the games that were coming out for the Wii U and are out were out for the Wii U is what implied me to buy it, and that's my same reason for buying the Switch. 
I want to get Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, and I'm also probably going to be, when they come out, Super Mario Odyssey. Obviously, why wouldn't I buy that? And also, um, Sonic Forces and Sonic Mania. Because I am pretty much a, uh, I am a Sonic fan. I do want to get some of those. Um, and obviously other games in the future, because I know they're going to release more for the Switch. It's a new system, so it's just starting up. But I can tell you this much, and I haven't seen any <coughs> Kirby games for the list. But I hope to see some Kirby games soon for the Switch. <coughs> I can see a lot. Though I do, I'm not saying when I say I could care less about the features. I mean, I don't mean I hate them. I mean, I I, I can appreciate the features. Just, those just have nothing. Those just have no, um, what is it? They just have no, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Um... They have no influence on my opinion. Just the games that are on a system. Now, back when I got a Wii or a 3DS, those two systems, oh, and regular DS, it was what was featured about the system that made me want it. And honestly, I love the Wii mainly because of its features. Uh, with the weird mode, the pointing and all that stuff, I, the Wii is one of my favorite systems, and that's why, so my nostalgia, all the games are, are Wii games. Because the Wii is the things, oh, the system I've had the most fun with. The thing, uh, system I played the most games on before I even got played very many Nintendo games. And I just had a lot of fun with it. And Wii Sports is one of those. Nanko Museum Remix. It's just been a fun system to play. So that's why that's every game that's on Summer of My Nostalgia has been a Wii game. Anyways, guys, I'm going to stop blobbing now. I'm going to let you all go. I actually need to get some fucking sleep. That's one thing. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Bye, guys. Take care.